Hey everyone, this is C-Rex and uh, today we're going to be unwrapping this uh, Tommy Chow plush. Actually, I ordered it a couple of uh, weeks ago. It's only just arrived today, so yeah, I thought I'd do a video just just me of me <laughs> unwrapping it. Um, I've already got the Dark Chow plush. Um, he came in a, a box. Uh, so I think this is just like a small toy that doesn't come with one. Um, I'm actually, I, I was thinking about showing the box, but I don't really think that's necessary. So yeah, we're trying to open this now. Might be a bit difficult because I've only got one hand free. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Yeah, I should have got some scissors really. At least it's it's quite easy to open. It's actually quite easy to open this. It's got like a little edge thing there. You can just rip. So here we go. Here's our little chow plush. go so yeah oh it's cute so yeah this is the uh tell me tell me uh neutral chow blush uh they've not made a hero chow as far as i'm as far as i know um only the dark chow and this little guy i'm gonna get the dark chow now just to show a bit of a size comparison do apologise if this video is a bit awkward or anything, I've never done an unboxing video before, so just bear with me. So yeah, here's the Dark Chow, and here's the Neutral Chow, or the Normal Chow, I don't know what, what you'd really call him, but yeah. He's about, I say he's about, ooh, about half the size. Actually a lot bigger than I was expecting, to be honest, I was expecting him to be about, um, I don't know about this big, but yeah, he's quite... Not bigger than I was expecting. I'm also quite happy as well that he's just arrived. Um, I know that some people have ordered things from America, uh, like this was, and um, they've had to pay silly custom charges, customs charges. So yeah, I'm quite pleased with that. But he's just arrived here, and uh, see if I can zoom in on him a bit. Yeah, the stitching's quite good quality on the eyes. It's got the same stitching as this dark shell plush. <laughs> I really do like this, uh, yeah, I've got a new phone and I quite like the camera on it, you can actually focus on stuff and it's really sharp, but yeah you can see all the stitching there, it's very high quality. I did see on another video someone criticised it a bit because it's got a big massive seam running down the middle of the head, um, yeah, it's kind of, it's, it's not too distracting, it would have been better if they'd done it like... I don't know, maybe hit it or something, but I don't I don't know, I don't do sewing and stuff like that, so I have no idea. But it doesn't look too bad. Um it's got a little <clears throat> sorry, a little hanger on his head, which uh oh yeah, focused in there. I don't really know but I think that's just for hanging it up in the store really. I don't really think there's much point in it. Um for normal use. The camera's not focusing for some reason. There we go. He's also got a big tag as well. Let's see if it says anything. No, it's just just standard copyright stuff. Hmm. Yeah. Dark Chow hasn't got one of those big tags. Um, he's just got a little one here. You know, actual tacky did come with a box though, so I guess that makes up for that. So yeah, that's uh, I guess that's the video done for now. Um, it's a bit out of the ordinary for me. I usually just do game play videos and stuff, but yeah, I think that was went quite well. Hope everyone enjoyed it, and maybe I will try and get some gameplay video up at some gameplay videos up at some point. Um, I'm actually thinking of doing one for my other channel, Force 13 Gaming, at some point. So maybe. We'll see something uploaded there. So yeah, um, hope everyone's enjoyed this and I'll see you all again soon. See ya.